What are the best free web hosts available right now? That's what we're gonna talk about in this video. What's up everybody, it's David from WebsiteCreativePro.com and in this video I wanna share with you my eight favorite free web hosts that you can use right now. Now personally, I don't recommend that you use a, web, a free web host for a long-term project. And what I mean by that is a website where you're trying to build it out to like 2,000, 3,000 visitors a day where it can be making uh, a significant income. Uh, instead, you want to go with a proper normal web host like SiteGround or Bluehost. Those are my two favorite for web people who are just starting out with their brand new website. Uh, simply because they're recommended by WordPress and they provide good hosting. SiteGround is the better of the two, but they are much more expensive. So they have a great introductory rate, but after the introductory rate, their price really increases, where Bluehost is the one of the best cheap web hosts. So it's really up to you which one you want to go with. I personally would recommend that you go with SiteGround and get a hosting package for two years at the introductory rate, and then after the two-year mark, you can make a decision whether or not you want to stick with SiteGround or move to a different web host. Um, obviously, Bluehost is a great option as well. Uh, anyways, let's get into the video right now that where I'll show you my favorite free web hosts. The best way to use a, a free web host is basically just like, like if you have like a little website, like say you have your name, you register your domain name and you just want to like have a website for your name and then show like your different accomplishments or projects that you're working on, whatever, just like a simple little site, then a free web host is perfect for that. Uh, anyways, I'm starting to ramble. Let's get into the list right now. Number one, 000webhost.com powered by Hostinger, which will be later on the list. This is a completely free web host, no strings attached, no hidden costs, 100% free. Uh, they do actually have uh, payment plans where you can get more services if you're willing to pay, but their most basic plan is actually free. And the thing that I like most about uh, 00webhost.com is that they actually have a simple auto installer for various scripts like WordPress. So you can simply install WordPress with an auto installer instead of like other free web hosts where you have to kind of fumble around and figure it out how to manually install WordPress. With a 00 web host, you can actually get a WordPress website set up for free without needing any like technical help. And they do offer a couple different price points right down here. So they have their free one, then they have 80 cents a month, and then they have $2.15 a month. If you're looking for a very cheap web host or free, check out 00webhost.com. Number two, x10hosting.com. It's another free, completely free web host. Not as good though as 00 web hosts in my opinion, uh, primarily because they offer a free hosting, but your website is gonna be a subdomain of x10hosting.com. So it's gonna be your website dot x10hosting.com. If you really want your own domain name, then you have to click on this and go to their premium hosting where you have to pay for a package. Uh, again, their premium price, their premium hosting, this x10premium.com is still very cheap, $6.99 a month. You know, for three years, you could pay, end up being paying $4 a month. So it's still not that expensive. But again, uh, their free hosting is only with a subdomain, whereas zero zero web hosting is like you can register your domain name at Namecheap, and then you can install WordPress and have a website at zero zero webhost.com if you choose. But, you know, 10x hosting is an alternative if you want to go the free route. Number three, infinityfree.net. This is one of the newer uh, free web hosts in existence and their unique selling point is that they provide a lot of services that a paid web host provides where they provide it for free. So they've been in business for over six years. They guarantee a 99.9 .9 uptime percent. There's no ads on your website and you can host any domain name you want. You don't have to use it as a subdomain so you can register your domain name at Namecheap and then use infinityfree.net as your web host and they come with a script installer so you can easily install WordPress, Joomla, Drupal with just a click of a button instead of having to figure out how to install things manually. And with your account, you get free cloud for CDN and you get free SSL certificates on all your websites. So I think uh, infinityfree.net is a really high value free web host. Number four, freehosting.com. Free hosting offers paid hosting and they also offer obviously free hosting. 
With a free hosting account, you just get web hosting for any domain name that you have registered on your own. So if you're looking to start a simple uh, WordPress powered website, for example, freehosting.com is a good choice. They do have some limitations. Uh, just, it's simply due to just keeping malware, phishing, other malicious activities, uh, as they say, uh, off their servers. And that's basically it. And with your free de with your free web hosting package, uh, you basically get 10 gigabytes of storage, you get unmetered bandwidth, you get one hosted website, you get one email account, you get one database, and you're not allowed to have any subdomains. Uh, basically, again, if you're just looking for to set up a website quickly and easily, uh, check out freehosting.com. Number five, freehostia.com. Freehostia is a business where they have a free hosting solution and they have a paid hosting solution with the goal of being get people to try the free hosting and then convert them later into paying customers. I really like Freehostia because you get quite a bit with your free account. You get five hosted domain names, you get a lot of disk space, you get a decent amount of monthly traffic, 100 meg 10 megabytes of monthly storage, one MySQL database. If we click on the read more, for their free chocolate plan, as they call it. So we come down here and we can check out different things that they offer, like basic features, and they have SSD caching, they have shared SSL IPs, one application installer, customer support, uh, security, uh, site management tools, FTTP, IP blocking, HT access generator. It's, you get quite a bit with this um, free Hostia account. So that is number five, the chocolate plan free hosting account with freehostia.com. Number six, awardspace.com. Awardspace is another free web host where they offer multiple plans. They have a free web hosting, basic plus, and a starter VPS. The cool thing about uh, web awardspace.com is that you do get a free .dx.am domain name. If you want one, you don't get a .com or .org obviously. For that, you need to go to Namecheap and register it on your own, but then you can turn around and use Award Space as a free web host. And there, for a free web hosting account, you do get quite a few different features. The activation is fee is free, the monthly price is free, uh, you get network uptime, you get guaranteed 99.9% .9 or less, but again, it's free. And yeah, that's it. So that is basically what you can expect from awardspace.com. Number seven is hostinger.com. Hostinger, to be honest, is not completely free. They're gonna set you back a whopping 80 cents a month. They're actually the company behind Zero Zero Web Host. With your Hostinger account, you get guaranteed 99% uptime, speed performance, 24 seven support chat, and a 30 day money back guarantee. So if you want your 80 cents back, I guess they'll just send you your 80 cents uh, back. With your plan, they offer a single premium business at different price points from zero, from 80 cents a month to $2 a month, to $3 a month. With the 80 cents a month plan, you get uh, one website, you get 10 gigabytes of SSD space, 100 gigabytes of bandwidth, one MySQL database. And that's pretty much it. You do get an easy website builder and they do allow you to have um, a powerful control panel so you can install easily, quickly install like WordPress thing I don't like though is that they don't come it doesn't come with a free SSL certificate so you know that's an issue because an SSL certificate is a small ranking factor with Google but you know if you're still looking for a very very affordable web host look no further than hostinger.com number eight blogger.com blogger.com is a free web host and most people don't even realize this when people think of blogger.com they always think that it's going to be some subdomain you can totally register your own domain name and then use blogger.com to power your website uh person that i think of who uses blogger.com is this guy johnny fd he gets thousands of visitors a day to his website and he doesn't pay for web hosting he pays for his domain name johnnyfd.com but the hosting 100 percent free because it's powered uh, right at the bottom right there, it's powered by Blogger. Now the issue is that you're stuck using Blogger. You don't have access to WordPress. You don't have access to WordPress plugins, all those various optimization things that WordPress can do. Um, so you are kind of limited to, you are limited to the Blogger platform. So just gotta make that a decision whether or not you want to go blogger.com. But if you've been looking to start a blog and have a free web host, uh, blogger.com is a good option. All right, that is it for this video. If you liked it, consider subscribing where I share more WordPress tutorials and various ways to make money online. Uh, Website Creative Pro, build you online. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.